they need to stay on there because we do not have enough wood. They can keep fishing for that. I don't need anyone in. And that can be deconstructed so that can be built. That looks all good. And then as soon as he's made the rest of those. <laughs> you cheeky bugger. You're nicking the wood from my construction site to build the cart. How dare you? <laughs> How dare you? <laughs> oh, that's hilarious. Right, harvest time. Send the labourers off for that. We are on harvest duty, gents. Or ladies and gents, I should say, because it's mostly going to be women doing it. We are well and truly on harvest duty, where we have people that I don't need them... I mean, I'll be honest, I don't have anyone where I don't need them. I mean, let's get the harvest done quickly, and then we can get back to uh, we can get back to building. And plus, this winter, we can actually do things properly because I'm not stretching and waiting for other stuff to happen. So yeah, let's focus on. Oh, there's no. There needs to be a worker. Now, can I? Yes, I can. I can set it to only heart only higher so i'm assuming i'm gonna go ahead and make an assumption here that on these hiring options if it doesn't give me an option i'm gonna go ahead and assume that you can only hire men is the is the idea i'm gonna go with i think maybe these kids are probably old enough now to start being in school because where's a seven-year-old there's one of them is seven year old yeah seven-year-old and probably a six-year-old. No, can't be a man. <laughs> I don't, yes, I don't have hiring options, but it needs to be a woman. I can't spare a guy doing education. I'm sorry. I cannot spare a guy doing education. It just can't happen. Uh, you can't do anything because you're on your own, so there's no point in having you there. That's enough wood to just keep things going. You want to just build because... You're not doing anything else, and otherwise you're waste. You're waiting for metal parts which are being created. How are we doing on workers? Um, okay. No, didn't I? Oh no, don't prioritize gathering. Go away. I can't afford to be using men permanently on a, as a worker on a field. Because I need you for construction and other stuff that I can't hire the women for. Because I don't have a choice. <laughs> right, as soon as that's done, then it's going to be a while... Till, so I can't preemptively do that, can I? No, I can't. Oh, force repair. Oh, you can. Okay, right. As soon as he's done those two, then I'm going to force repair those three, probably, so that they're all around about the same wear level. Actually, that's a really bad idea, because then I'll have to do all of them at once. I'm going to leave them, and then he'll only have to repair kind of one, maybe two at a time. That's a much better idea. That's a much, much better idea. Why are... Oh, because when it's harvested, it flips over. I think. <laughs> he says. Maybe we'll just have to... I think we might actually have to... Um... I think we might have to do a fallow for both of them anyway. They're pretty destroyed. I mean, in theory, we should be able to do all of them as fallow. In theory. Okay, this is getting slightly problematic now because we have stuff happening that we can't do in winter. I kind of need to get this harvest complete. Okay, what I'm going to do is I'm going to temporarily sacrifice the construction because we need to get this harvest done and we're only two fields in. Because I'm, from experience, well, I say from experience, I'm like 99.9% .9 sure that if we let this go to winter with crops in the field, they die. Because that's what happens in real life as well. So I think we need to prioritize getting things harvested because we can't afford to them for them to stay in the fields. And we only have 25 people. <laughs> well, I say we only have 25 people. We actually have less than that because we only have 18. Christ, we only have 18. We really cannot afford to have six of them fishing. I'm so glad I cancelled that other fishing boat. I think she'd probably build a house behind you. So I don't think they've been... Oh, uh, they haven't been prioritising them because they're not active. Oh, you dum-dum. 
Silly, silly boy. They haven't been doing it because they're not active. Ay, 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 ay. Right, buckwheat is nearly complete with the harvesting. Nice, so we've got, a, we've got a good amount of everything. We just need to, um... I mean, we can spend the winter working through it. It's just a pain in the ass getting this guy. Uh, what I'm going to do, though, is I'm going to put a bunch of benches down on places. Because I remember I've made this mistake before when I haven't put benches down. And people don't have to, don't have places to rest. And they end up going all over the damn shop. But if we put random benches down here, there and everywhere, then they don't have to go back to the, the village centre to rest, which is a mistake. As I said, I have made before. And I will not be making again. I kind of just need to spread them out all over the place, because they don't cost anything, as far as I'm aware. And in doing that, we can probably get rid of this. Bingo. And actually, we can probably, as well, do uh, two cart parkings back to back. Nice one. And then we will do them after... That's been that. That's done that. Okay, we probably need two people back on that once they are completed. Uh, have you done all them? No, you haven't yet. You're actually... What are you doing? You're actually building stuff. Not entirely sure what you're actually doing, but okay. Do you know what? Actually, we're going to take you off because you can do that during the winter. What the hell am I thinking? Uh, so sort of four people there. Five... Six. No one's old enough to be taught yet, so you can get out of there. So we're using six people. Seven. One. Ah, here, there's number eight. That's where number eight is. That's where I'm using all of my people. Okay, so we just we just need to overall we just need to be really really strategic about how we use up resources, where we place people, where we allocate people. Because a lot of stuff is purely down to the fact that we only have a limited amount of men that can only do a limited amount of... Well, we only have a limited amount of men that we need for more jobs than we have people. And we only have a limited amount of jobs that we can hire women into to replace the men where we need them elsewhere. That makes sense in my head. It probably doesn't make sense <laughs> out loud. But it makes sense in my head. <laughs> right. So, harvesting is entirely priority at the moment, to the point where I'm actually going to place everything on pause and get you out of there. There's no one on building, that's fine. You're creating wood, which I actually need. Yeah, I need I need all hands on deck. I need all hands on deck for this, uh, for this harvest to get it done before it gets to winter, which is only a month and a half away. You know, I used to say that the, this game was uh, one of the easier ones to record. I'm not sure it's one of the easy ones to edit. I've been recording for nearly an hour to do one year. I guess that's how much more stressful it is when you're allocating people left, right and centre because you only have a limited amount of people to do it with. Right, our harvest is complete and now it's purely down to uh, collecting up all of the buckets of sunflowers and getting them back to the farm. I suppose we can actually... Should we... I don't know how many women are looking for jobs. None. But there will be when they stop being labourers. And we're going to need a lot of people to... Uh, to work through all of this. We need a hell of a lot of people. Uh, do you want to sell... That seems pointless selling apples because they're not grown yet. Do you want to sell flour instead? That would make a lot more sense. You know, they are growing nicely. They are really, really growing nicely, those are. Might actually be worth making um, another few orchards. Because they take a while to come through. I don't know really where else I could put one. I suppose I could do it behind here, and we could always demolish them. What, how many variations can you have? I can't remember. We'll build one, and then we'll find out. <laughs> I think you can have... If I remember rightly, I want to say apples, apricots, and cherries, but I don't... Cherries grow on trees? Do you know, I genuinely can't remember. I think you can have three variants. I think you can have three variants, so we'll do three. <laughs> I may be wrong in that, but I think you can have three variants. Oh, nice, all the bushels are complete. Um, right, okay, in that case, 
you can get back to working on there. You can go back in there. We've got two people working on there. Uh, we've got tons of fish. The people looking for work, but I don't have work for you. Actually, to be honest with you, women can go in there. You can just, you can go in there. I have nothing else for you to do. Um, and then I guess construction. Do you want to finish that off? And then, can you do that in that time, man? And then as soon as that's finished, I will put you on to construction as well because we have more than enough flour. Right, jump on that. You can go and help with construction as well because we are building a house still. And then we'll remove another one of these houses so they can actually grow stuff for themselves. Yeah, we're starting to grow stuff for ourselves. Awesome. That'll be a lot less of a burden on me food wise. Wonder how big you can actually make these. <gasps> Jeez. And you can like pop it right in the corner. Wowza. They can grow a lot of damn food. <laughs> Holy crap. <laughs> Holy crap. Right, in the future then, I think you can't edit them once you've done them, can you? No, you can't. So, I think in the future we will actually Well actually I don't know, because they've made they're making a decent amount of food just from a property like that. It's not bad at all. Not gonna lie, it's not bad at all. I don't know. I don't know if they can sell their stuff directly to other people in the village. I don't know that they can I don't know whether they can do that or not. I might actually have to tweet at the dev and ask ask them if um ask them if that's a, 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 a thing that happens because I would be interested to, that's something I would genuinely be interested to find out I'm going to tweet at them after I've done this video to find that out don't know whether they'll reply but <laughs> it's worth it's worth a try right that is tons of charcoal going left right and center windmill is still turning despite the fact that no one's in it but whatever oh house is complete right do you want to move into, actually, who's got kids? It's just you and you that I need to move, isn't it? Yeah. Right. You have kids, so you can move first. And you can get dismantled. And then we'll build the other two cart lodges. And then... Are you still building that? Jeez, man. Ha. Huh. That's something I never noticed. They have to... Oh, she's pregnant as well. Oh, I didn't if <laughs> Fair enough. Fair enough. I, I genuinely did not even know that that was a thing. Obviously, <laughs> obviously it being pregnant was a thing, but I genuinely didn't know that that was something that displayed. So it was her, wasn't it? Yeah, four months. Jeez, nice. Education zero of five. Oh dear. <laughs> well, congrats, mate. You're going to be a father. Nice one. Um, actually, is she pregnant then? No, she is not. I'm glad I moved that family first. I wonder what the limit on children is. I'm assuming two. There is a joke there about a certain Asian country that I'm not going to make because it'll probably get me in trouble. But there's a joke there. Congrats to you if you get it. <laughs> okay, it's going to take a while for them to plant anything. So that'll be next year. We're about to go into winter. Do you want to go and make a bunch of that because there is nothing you can do oh actually we need to make a second stall don't we because of the buckwheat can i no i can't balls because we need to sell buckwheat um buh, 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 buh. i suppose actually oh, oh okay okay so this is something i want to try so what's something that everyone has everyone has by the looks of it Everyone has garlic, but I don't make garlic. So, okay, not everyone has garlic, but I still don't make garlic. So, if I put garlic on here, I'm wondering if they will purchase from within the village. That's going to be something interesting to keep an eye on. Uh, the other thing that we were... Yeah, so apples, apricots, and cherries. That's what it was. That's what they make. It's cherries. Did I say cherries? I genuinely can't remember. 
Um, and we made, we can't make butter, unfortunately, because we can't have any animals. Uh, I don't think I can sell sunflowers. I think we actually need, yeah, I can only sell sunflower oil. And we probably should actually find somewhere to put a, I can't even remember what it is. What's the building that does sunflowers? An oil workshop. I don't know if that needs an animal. I don't think it does. But it could. <laughs> can I pop it right there? I can pop it right there. Beautiful. Right, that's being deconstructed nicely. Still need people in that. I still need you in there because you're taking a year and a decade to make a bloody cart. Mostly because you don't have any labourers. Oh, because I turned the labourers off because I'm an idiot. I'm just going to have one person on there. I need the rest of you as labourers. I need you to be doing stuff. Oh, we only have 100 left. Oh, there's 500 in there. Okay. Is that what the storage capacity is? It's 500. Should we just put 1,000 in there? We can't. Is my... Yeah, no, my numpad was turned off. Let's put 1,000 in there. And then... We can get rid of camp storage. I definitely don't want to destroy them. Okay. So, that is the end of... Pretty sure I just saw that have garlic in it. Okay, so we're selling stuff. We are selling stuff. And we are in December. So, you can come off of the fisheries because you're not going to be working. And get your ass on construction. Nice. We have 600 in there. So, that's going to do us a year. Oh, crap. Okay, we might have to have stuff built by the end of this year, then. In that case... This is not breaking the rules. We're going to have to build it. We are only buying iron. Only buying iron. Because we can't physically get it in the game and it's a core material. We need it to progress. So I do not consider that cheating in any way, shape or form. Uh, we've run out of firewood. We, we, we're running out of firewood. You need to go and... Oh no, we're not running out of firewood. There's just no one's gone and got it. Okay, that's a, that's a thing. <laughs> eight carts in order oh my god right we are building um oil workshop is going up nice we might just get that done before the end of the year he says as he's been recording for 120 minutes 120 minutes an hour and 20 minutes Jeez, this year has taken me what well, will have taken me nearly an hour and a half by the time i'm finished Okay, I'm going to surrender to the fact that I don't think I can internally sell crops. Yeah, I don't think I can. I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna submit to that. I don't think I can. Maybe the villagers themselves can. Well, but they maybe really need to because they've got loads of other stuff. But yeah. Please say you can hire just by just women in this. Like, surely. Why? <laughs> Why is that a thing? Why can women not do that job? That doesn't make any sense. Well, at least we, at least the things are going up fast. Uh, we might as well do... Oh my god, it's mid-January. Righto. Damn, we have made a lot of progress. So, before um, planting season comes back, hopefully we'll have built these two orchards and get the trees planted in them. We'll be able to make some sunflower oil and start selling that. Um, I'm glad I cancelled off that second fishing port because if we've only got 18 men, we cannot spare six of them. Having two boats being used and then when one gets damaged, they can use the other one and then I can repair all three of them um that's fine by me that gives me a little bit more leeway we're having two people almost completely on forestry now just because we need it some of that always coming from that the only game thing breaking thing we're having to do is buying the ore really and we've got seven more carts to build we've got eight carts to build damn son and hopefully next year we will have someone that is old enough i oh they one of the people i moved here fair enough uh, hopefully we'll find out what year or what age children have to be to go to school. 
So ladies and gents, once again, there is a vote in my community tab of my YouTube page concerning my upload schedule. If you have time to go and vote on it, I would very, very much appreciate it. And if anyone has an idea for a name for our village, then please do leave it down in the comments below. And as always, thank you very much for watching. Thank you very much for your support. And I'll see you in year number three.